Hello everybody, Bill Harrison here with Harden Power Systems. Wanted to introduce you to a new product that we have that we're real excited about. Um, it's called the Long Shot. It is a continuous DC power source for the GoPro Hero 3 series of cameras. Um, these cameras are amazing and they're seeing a lot of use, um, but the power supply is a, a chronic issue, especially for power users. Um, it's a small camera, it's a small battery, so if you set the camera up to, to be real aggressive in its settings, um, uh, like resolution and frame rate and so forth, uh, you can kill that battery very quickly, 20 minutes, um, uh, thereabouts. So in any case, uh, uh, what we have developed, we believe, is uh, the first device of its kind in the world. It is a, a direct DC power supply that will correctly power the GoPro camera using any 12 volt power source. The, uh, the long shot power control unit is uh, it's quite small. It is an inch by two by three. It's a, uh, an extruded aluminum case with high density polyethylene end caps. After the electronics is, are, are installed and the wiring is complete, this is, is potted using a, uh, a liquid epoxy that, that makes this extremely durable. Um, it effectively makes it like a solid mass. Um, it, for the most part, it's crush proof. Uh, you'd have a hard time hurting it unless you did it on purpose. Uh, very simple to operate. There's a voltmeter that will light up here in a minute but a voltmeter that shows you you're getting good power from your DC source and a couple of cords. One goes to the battery or to the vehicle, the other one goes to the camera. On the camera side, what we've done that is, uh, that is different, many people are struggling to power the, the GoPro uh, through the USB ports. Um, and there's another connector on the back of the camera that the, uh, the backpack system uses. Um, but, you know, these are, are primarily data ports. A at best, they're low power uh, ports. And uh, it's very problematic. A lot of people have, have found this after losing a lot of time and uh, energy, effort, money um, by, by losing footage that they thought they were getting when they were running uh, through the USB ports for power. Um, one of the things that, uh, that, that is unique about this system, most people will recognize this if they're GoPro users. This is a GoPro waterproof case. Comes standard with most of the GoPro cameras. What we've done different is created what you might think of as a, as a fake battery. It's got the power terminals in the same location as a factory battery does but it's been permanently attached to the back of the door. There's a, a, a pool of epoxy in here. That by way of assembly, it's, it's, it's trapped. And that epoxy creates a completely watertight seal and also very strong strain relief. It's very durable the way this is put together. Um, but when you, when you get a, a long shot system, it comes with this door that just snaps on to the the, the, the larger housing itself. No tools, you just snap it on. And I'll show you how that interfaces. Here we have a standard GoPro Hero 3 camera. You can see that there's no battery inside. Nothing up my sleeve, no tricks here. This is a dead camera. What we'll do, we'll take the camera, like you normally would, and insert it into the case and then we'll just close the door. Now when you close the door the, uh, the battery swings into the back of the camera. If you can quite see that. Now I'll lock it closed. So now we have an otherwise normal Hero 3 in its waterproof case except in this case we've got a pigtail. The pigtail, incidentally, these are really nicely made. These are for uh, uh, scuba diving uh, lighting systems. It's a waterproof connection, uh, very tough. Um, 
So, we'll take the connection from the long shot, attach it to the pigtail on the camera, and now these two units are connected to one another in a watertight fashion. With the system, you'll get three different uh, means of, of power connection. Uh, uh, one is this, which is just a standard cigarette-style plug. Um, the other is a set of, uh, of battery clamps. And the third is a set of, uh, of ring terminals. All three are just meant to, to make a reliable connection to a 12-volt source. The most common is going to be the, the cigarette-style attachment. With this, of course, you can plug the long shot into a vehicle. Uh, uh, oftentimes, motorcycles are also sporting these sockets. Um, and as long as that vehicle's got power, then so does your camera. So we'll plug this adapter into the long shot. And in this case, I'll get kind of a twofer. I get to mention our second generation Revolt power supply. Um, this is a, a 12 volt portable, uh, almost indestructible, waterproof, crush proof uh, DC power source. Ham radios, uh, cell phones, small appliances, walkie talkies, uh, very useful. In this case we're just going to plug into the standard 12 volt outlet after we power the, the system on. So when I plug the long shot into the power source, and again, this could be any power source, any battery that, uh, that puts out 12 volts, you'll see that the, the meter on the long shot is reading power. It's showing us 13.6 volts. Um, this converter will actually work uh, on paper, it'll work with as little as, as 10 volts. Um, so you could squeeze a lot of power out of a dying battery in order to run your GoPro. Um, but in any event, we're plugged in now. And here's our camera. Again, you remember that there was no battery in this. We haven't cut the scene. Um, and uh, I'll hit the power button on the camera. And it'll power up. And you'll see that it's showing a full battery. And it should be a full battery because in a case like this, we've, we've got something in the neighborhood of 15 to 20 times the capacity of a standard GoPro battery. So basically what we have is continuous power for your GoPro 3, a watertight connection, a complete system that will allow you to, uh, to run this camera on a, a, a vehicle, airplane, boat, motorcycle, whatever, um, and... Uh, no more lost footage. So, if you want to check out our system, we'd love you to see it. Come to PortableUniversalPower.com. Uh, the system is available now. Uh, we, are, uh, we are shipping starting in a couple days. The first, the first lots will, uh, will leave our shop. Um, very reasonable price. Uh, very good uh, machine and the first of its kind in the world. So, again, come to PortableUniversalPower.com. We'd love to see you there. Appreciate your time. This is Bill Harrison. I'll talk to you later.